Today, after the news, stay tuned for a report on the Georgian Square International Music Festival, which is unfolding in Bucharest. But first, a quick look at the weather in Romania, which is extremely hot. Ten counties in the west and east are under code orange alert for extreme weather. According to warnings issued by the National Weather Administration, temperatures in these areas will exceed 38 degrees Celsius. The noon reading in Bucharest was 31 degrees. First, the news with Cristina Matescu. The headlines. Cultural events are held simultaneously in Romania, the Republic of Moldova, and abroad to celebrate Romanian Language Day. The new fiscal code and the postal voting bill are among the priorities of the Romanian Parliament after its summer research. And Romania took over on Monday the command and control of the NATO multinational division Southeast. The foreign ministry in Bucharest hails the celebration of Romanian language an opportunity to cherish their cultural and linguistic heritage for Romanians in all corners of the world and those who speak and learn Romanian. Romania's foreign minister Bogdan Aurescu said in a press release that Romanian Language Day is celebrated on the 31st of August both in Romania and abroad through a series of events that celebrate Romanian history and culture and the important contribution of the Romanian language to European and world heritage. Many Romanian embassies, consulates and cultural institutes abroad have held events to mark this celebration, including traditional music shows, poetry recitals, exhibitions dedicated to Romanian writers, public talks, film screenings, theatre performances, participations in ethnographic festivals and meetings of Romanian ethnic communities in the region. Romanian is the native language of around 30 million people and is being taught as a foreign language in universities in 45 different countries around the world. The new fiscal code and postal voting bill for as living abroad are two of the priorities of the Romanian parliament when it returns from the summer recess on September the 1st. The interim president of the Social Democratic Party, Liviu Dragnea, says he would like to see parliament sittings engage in dialogue rather than be dominated by the war between power and the opposition. The Social Democrat Prime Minister, Victor Ponta, has also said that the law on state employees' salaries, which provides for higher salaries in the public sector, as well as the 2016 state budget and the procurement law, could be adopted by November the 1st through political consensus. The Liberal Party in opposition, through its co-president Alina Gorghiu, has called for the passing by November the 1st of the postal voting bill. She says that drafting a new law does not make sense, as the bill already contains the requirements formulated by the Romanian communities abroad. <laughs> 